What is up guys? Joey Robbins here and today we will be ranking cartoon TV series. And good deal. Chat is up and I see you guys are tuning in. Welcome. So yeah, we're going to have ourselves a little marathon here. I selected a bunch of cartoon series and of course there's a lot more but these are the ones for the most part that I watched as a kid and remember at least most of them some of these you'll have to help me so yeah without further ado guys let's get started so I'm going to start with how about Alf so I remember as a kid enjoying like the live action segments right the actual cartoons were not that good <laughs> so yeah i wasn't really a fan of the whole cartoon series i just kind of appreciated the live segments so i'll probably give alf like an e i don't think it's an i don't think it's entirely shit but it's not you know great <laughs> you know <laughs> hey the robots what's up buddy adventure time yeah <laughs> it's gonna be a little marathon <laughs> all right so yeah and you guys are more welcome to disagree or you know we can have our debate so okay how about alvin and the chickmunks so of course you know they're classic well-known pretty good Comparing them with the other TV shows, the cartoon shows, I think they're okay. I would probably give them, this is probably where I'll get criticized, I think they're average. That's my opinion. I think it's a C. Hey Eric, how you doing buddy? You think B for chickmunks? Tell you what, if we get more positive votes here, I'll bump it up. I, I think it's average. I was thinking B, but I think it's average. But, you know, again, I'm comparing it with, you know, the other cartoon shows. So, okay. Now, how about Tom and Jerry? Oh, Tom and Jerry. So, like, I wasn't really ever a big fan of Tom and Jerry but like I did watch a lot of their episodes yeah I think they're I kind of put Tom and Jerry with Alvin and the Chunk Chickmunks in my eyes like I think it's just average um I know they're classic but I don't know the classic that like eh You see F for Tom and Jerry. <laughs> F. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Let's put it. I think it's better than Alf. We'll say D. Okay. So I was a little afraid to go lower. But I'm not going to disagree with that. <laughs> okay. D sounds good to me. Okay. Now. This one I'm probably going to annoy people. The Flintstones. Another one that's pretty well known. I was never a big Flintstones fan, to be honest with you. Hmm. <laughs> B. I'm gonna go... I'm going to go C for Flintstones. People are going to be like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Like, I thought about a B, but I I'm just not that crazy for the Flintstones. You know? Oh, really? <laughs> wow, an F. All right, we'll, we'll put it at C. Okay. Now... Here's another great classic, right? Big, well-known classic. Uh, Garfield and Friends. 
So I, I will say this, out of all the ones that we've talked about so far, I, I do like Garfield over all these. So I'm going to give Garfield a B. I couldn't give it higher. To me, it's not an A or an S. But I think it's a B. I would definitely watch Garfield over Alvin and the Flintstones, you know? Hey, Angel. How you doing, buddy? <laughs> See, a lot of people are disagreeing with me with Flintstones. Although, there was a couple of negatives. So, I think... I guess C is the right spot for it. Okay. How about Family Guy? Well, Family Guy. F for Garfield? No, Garfield's not an F. B for Garfield. See, I, I think it's more B. <laughs> F for Garfield. What do you guys think of Family Guy? Pretty funny. I was thinking possibly... A, I'm going to go B with Family Guy. Only because I'm comparing it with others. That's why. But a B, you know, it's respectable. You know. Oh, D. Ooh. Really? Okay. I haven't watched a lot of episodes of Family Guy, so... A joke. Oh, okay. Maybe that's my problem, because it seemed like it was very good in the beginning, but I haven't watched a lot of it, you know? Hmm. Well, I'll tell you what, if that's true, we'll put Family Guy in the C column. There you go. We'll, we'll say it's average. You guys convinced me. Okay, uh, how about G.I. Joe's? G.I. Joe! <laughs> you know, it's funny, I was never a big fan of G.I. Joe. I had a couple of the action figures. I watched a couple of the episodes, but overall, I was, you know, not really into it. Uh, hmm. What do you guys think of G.I. Joe? Family Guy's a D. I'll tell you what, if it gets more negative, maybe Family Guy will go to D. Okay, you're you're like me. You only saw a couple episodes of G.I. Joe. Yeah. I mean, there's a reason why I only watched a couple episodes. I'll put G.I. Joe at a D. That's probably pretty accurate. Okay. Now, how about Chip and Dale? Rescue Rangers, Chip and Chip and Dale. I, I love the theme song. And actually, I really enjoyed the cartoon series. I... Watched a bunch of it. Um, I'd probably give it a B. I was thinking A, but I don't think it's an A. It's pretty good, though. I do like it. I'm going to put Chip and Dale in the B column. Boom. Got a great theme song, I will say that. One of my favorites. Okay. Here's another old classic. The Jetsons. Now, I watched a bunch of Jetsons back, you know, when I was a little kid. Like, five years old. But overall, I never really got that into it, you know. Once I was introduced to other cartoons, I was like, eh, I don't like the Jetsons, you know. Believe it or not... I would, oh, I dare to do this. I'd probably give the Jetsons an E because I really didn't care for it. I mean, I'd rather watch Tom and Jerry and I guess G.I. Joe. So, I'm going to put it in the E. Yeah, 
F for her sons. <laughs> F for her sons. <laughs> oh, man. Um, how about Goof Troop? <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> freaking goofy, freaking pedophile cartoon character. That one, that one part always makes me laugh when he goes, Hey, Maxie, you ever seen a grown man naked? <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> what the hell's wrong with you? <laughs> um, Goof Troop's okay. I think it's a C. I don't think it's as good as Chippendale and Garfield, so I'm going to give it a C. But it's not bad. F for Jetsons. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, you guys really don't like the Jetsons, just like myself, so... Okay. Cool. I I don't think it's an F, though, but, it, yeah. Wasn't really into it. I think there are cartoons on... in this selection here that, uh... It's gonna be worse. You'll see. Here, why don't we do this one? How about... Care Bears? <laughs> Freaking Care Bears. Now, I don't know how to rate this, because obviously this isn't my thing. <laughs> I watched a couple episodes. Again, I was a little kid. Like, you know, you just watch shit when you're, <laughs> when you're little, you know? Um, freaking Care Bears. Oh, is Goofy your favorite Disney character? That's cool. Hey, Lexi. Hey, Austin. Rest in peace, Kobe. Yeah. I'm going to give Care Bears an F because there's no way I could give <laughs> I would never watch it. <laughs> That's just care that you guys would say. You're probably like, I don't watch no Care Bears. <laughs> <laughs> well, Lexi gave it an E. We'll just say F. <laughs> okay, now this one, I'll, I'll probably shock you guys. Since we're talking about bears and stuff. How about gummy bears? Now, let me tell you about the gummy bears. I actually kind of liked this cartoon series. I actually really like the theme song. Um, for those of you that saw my top 10 favorite cartoon theme songs, know that, like, I think it made number 10. So, um, in a weird way, I'm a little nostalgic for this cartoon. But, um, hmm. I mean, I dare to give it a B. I don't know. I don't know if it's as good as Chip and Dale, though. Uh. I'll I'll give gummy bears a C, but it's to me like a C plus. Like everything in the C column, I would watch gummy bears over these others. So, but yeah, I don't think it's as good as Garfield and Chip and Dale. Not quite. I should do basketball next time. It'd be cool. What topic? Um, okay, how about this one? How about Inspector Gadget? That's another great theme song. Inspector Gadget. Inspector Gadget. <laughs> go, Gadget, go. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Actually, you know what? Inspector Gadget, I give a B because I really enjoyed watching it. And I was always, like, hoping to see, like, Dr. Claw, you know, because all you, all you would see is his hand. And there was a couple episodes where they tease you, like, you, you thought you were going to see his face, and you never did. Yeah, I, I really like Inspector Gadget. I don't think it's an A, though, but, yeah, I would put it up with uh, Chip and Dale. I think it's pretty solid. It's funny. Yeah, B for Gadget. Yeah, you guys agree with me. I think it's a B. Um, all right, 
Here's a great classic. For real. Scooby-Doo. Scooby, Scooby-Doo. Where are you? Now, believe it or not, I don't know if I could give Scooby-Doo an S, though. I could probably, I mean, definitely an A. I don't know if I can give it an S. As great as it is. Because there, believe it or not, there's a couple other cartoons I would pick over it. Scooby Doo is awesome, you know. I'll give Scooby Doo an A. What's Scooby Doo? You've never seen Scooby Doo, Lexi? You have to. It's amazing. It is really good. Another one with a great theme song. Um, okay, how about... Now we're doing some older ones. How about Yogi Bear? Hey, Yogi, hey, boo-boo. Hey, boo-boo. Wanna sniff my testicles, boo-boo? <laughs> <laughs> I'm smarter than the average bear. God, this thing. I never really cared for Yogi Bear. The only thing I like about it is just make fun of him. <laughs> Um. Mm. Any of you guys like Yogi Bear? <laughs> hey, boo boo. My butt itches. Will you go down there and sniff it? <laughs> Yogi. D for Yogi. Okay. Oh, did you Austin? Yeah. Scooby Doo was awesome. A for Yogi? What? Get out of here. Ain't no A. <laughs> you never watched Scooby-Doo and you're giving Yogi Bear a fucking A? No way. <laughs> you're trolling. <laughs> in, in all fairness, if you really do like Yogi Bear, that's cool. Don't, you know. But, um, I personally don't care for Yogi. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, when I was a little kid, Yogi Bear, I mean, you know. But, you know, like, when you're a little kid, you'll pretty much watch anything, you know what I mean? Uh, I'll tell you what, we'll, we'll respect Yogi. I'm not going to give it an F. I'm going to give it an E, because <laughs> I think I would rather watch Tom and Jerry. So, <laughs> I'll put it there with the Jetsons. That's probably pretty accurate for me. Uh, now, this one I've been recently watching, the 2000 Pokemon. Now, Pokemon, I'll tell you, I'm actually impressed. The, the, videos, the video games got me hooked, so kind of made me a big fan. Now, I'm trying to think where I would rank it, though. It is really good. I like it. I'm uh, deciding between a B and an A. Probably a B. I don't know if I could put it on par with Scooby Doo. Oh. I don't know. It's pretty good. D or D for Pokemon? D, D. What? No way. You guys do not like it. I'm, I'm talking about the 2000, not the newer one. I heard the newer one's not very good. First two regions, S for Pokemon, but after that, F. yeah, I'm talking about the, this is uh, 2000, right? So, yeah, I heard the newer ones weren't that great. Huh. Then A. Yeah. Because the 2000 is really good. But yeah, I've heard the later ones are very weird and not nearly as good. So, I'll tell you what. We'll put it in the A 
call him here. Danae. Okay. Eric says S for the 2000. Yeah, that's the one I'm talking about. Hey, Oscar. How you doing, buddy? Um, okay, so... How about... Muffet Babies. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I used to watch this a bunch, but... It's okay. It's actually not as bad as it sounds, you know? Muffet Babies! Or where would I put it, you know? Hmm. Muffet Babies. Where would I put that? No higher than a C, but maybe a little lower. I don't know. A for Muffet Babies. See, I don't know if I could go that high. That's cool if you really like it. I can understand. I don't think it is bad. See, the, the thing is, is like, just because if I put it, like, say, at a C, doesn't mean it's bad, you know? Um, I just don't think it's on par with, like, Pokemon and Scooby-Doo. And in my opinion, I don't think it's on par with Inspector Gadget, Chip and Dale, Garfield. I'll tell you what, we'll put it, we'll make it a C. Okay. Now, this one's a weird one, but I watched it. Quite a few episodes of it. Foster's, Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. It's very weird. Uh, it's not terrible, but eh, at the same time, it's actually very weird. In fact, I'm just going to give it... I'm going to give it an E. It's just so weird. I would definitely care less about watching it again, that's for sure. <laughs> um, yeah, let's let's go ahead and talk about The Simpsons. So, The Simpsons. I'm kind of curious what you, all you guys think. I mean, to me, The Simpsons is pretty damn good. Uh, I think it's an A. I love the Halloween specials. I, I I dig that. That's for sure. Where's SpongeBob? And you know, I was thinking about adding Dexter's Laboratory. Maybe I will once we get through this list. Uh, Austin thinks The Simpsons is a B. Up. Until season 10 S. Yeah. After. After that. A or a B. Okay. Yeah. I was just kind of curious what you all think. You know. Because. You know. I don't know if I should give it an A or an S. You know. Hmm. Tell you what. Because I really do love their Halloween specials. In fact, out of all the cartoons, definitely my favorite. By far. I'm going to put it. In the S tier. An S. Hmm. All right. That's our first S, arguably. Uh, okay, how about Transformers? Transformers, robots in disguise. So, I mean, the cartoon, too bad the movie's kind of... Well, I need to watch the movies. I actually like the first one, but I heard they kind of, you know... Went downhill. But, um... 
the the cartoon series is really good. Hmm. I think where I would put Transformers. It's been a long time since I've seen it. You think a C? That's what I was kind of thinking. Transformers probably will be a C. I'll tell you what. We'll, we'll say C. For now. Maybe we'll change it, but... I'll say C. It's been a long time since I've seen it, so. Okay, now. How about Ghostbusters? Now, remember this one. Now, note, this is the shitty one. This isn't the real Ghostbusters. This is like the, sh <laughs> the fake Ghostbusters. With the really weird ass characters. In fact, you know what? I'm just going to tell you guys right off the bat. Because it did, f you know, it flopped so bad. It's an F. It's down there with Care Bears. I think it sucks. It's shit. <laughs> but the, where is it? I'm blind as a bat. Where is it? Wait, did I not include the real Ghostbusters on here? I don't see it. Hold on a second. What the heck? Let me fix that. Let me see if I can get an image of it. That's where I added it. Huh. Did I not... You know what? I'll download an image here in a second. Apparently I didn't... I can't believe I did not have an image of that. Alright, that's weird. But we will mention that. <laughs> Angel says F. Yeah, I mean, that version of Ghostbusters was shit. Can't believe I didn't include the, the real Ghostbusters. Weird. Okay, but we will. Alright, so how about Dennis the Menace? Dennis, Dennis the Menace. It's okay. But personally, I'd give it a D. D for Dennis. <laughs> I'm just gonna go D for Dennis. <laughs> Um, how about Animaniacs? Animaniacs. Good theme song. Hmm. What do you guys think of an Animaniacs? Dennis is an E. Hmm? It could be. I think it's a D, though. Hmm. See, for Animaniacs, I was thinking a B. Oh, an E. Woo. C. Okay. Say what? Well, we'll go C. Maybe, maybe that's more accurate, actually. Yeah, actually, now thinking about it, I don't think it's as good as Inspector Gadget, Chip and Dale. Okay. All right, how about... Beavis and Butthead. Oh, Beavis and Butthead. See, like, <laughs> they're funny, but... I don't know. I never thought they were that great, personally. It was just kind of amusing to see cartoon characters like them, you know? 
I'm going to put them, believe it or not. I'm going to make them an E. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really care for Beavis and Butthead. All right, now, how about King of the Hill? Oh, Hank and Bobby. Hank would go, Bobby, were you in my drawers? I'm going to grab my belt and beat you, boy. Bobby, God damn it! Stop looking at my penis. Are you gay, Bobby? <laughs> Oh, B for B. Oh. All right. Well, if we get more positive, then I'll, I'll bump it up. But <laughs> Oh, Bubba. Yeah, King of the Hill was pretty good. But there were some episodes I was kind of like, eh. It's kind of a mixed bag for me. I'll say it's a B. It is, it is kind of funny. I do kind of like it. King of the Hill. Bubba. All right. How about Woody Peckerhead? Yeah, too. <laughs> Freaking Woody Peckerhead piece of shit. I never really cared for Woody. I'm probably going to annoy people. I'm sure it's got a pretty good fan base, but for me, I think uh, Woody Woodpecker is probably looking at this chart. I would say it's a D. We'll get you. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> uh. F for Woody, so annoying. He Woody is quite annoying. Yeah, you know, maybe D is quite generous. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Why don't we do this? Because I think you guys have convinced me. Beavis and Butthead ranked up to a D, and Woody Peckerhead is an E now. I don't think it's an F. I don't think it's as bad as Ghostbusters and Care Bears, but I do agree. He is a, a very annoying character. And get to. Like, God. <laughs> All right. Now, this one will probably make people laugh. How about Winnie the Pooh? Now, in all fairness, like, I watched a bunch of it, you know, as a little kid. It's not a terrible cartoon show. Um, but I would probably give it, I'll give it a D. Because I would watch it over Woody Peckerhead and Yogi Bear and Jetsons. So, yeah. I actually give Winnie the Pooh a little more respect than that. E for Pooh, yeah. I don't know. Like I said, I'm just going off this chart, and I would rather watch that over, you know, what's in the E column, so. Uh, okay, now this one, I've loved the cartoon movies. Uh, of Aladdin. The first two, well... The first one's awesome. Second one, The Return of the Jafar. I think it's okay. It's got a couple flaws. And the third one's same thing. It's okay. But I actually really enjoyed the cartoon series. I would probably... I actually really did enjoy it. I, I dare to give it... Well, I don't know if I'd give it an A. I actually do like it. <laughs> a for Aladdin. <laughs> There was some weird, like, villains, too. I think there was one, like, nerdy, make, uh, like, smart dude that was called, like, Mechanicles or something. I would say a B. I was thinking B, yeah. I was almost gonna be biased and give it an A, but yeah, I think B is more accurate. It's actually pretty solid. It It's pretty entertaining. They didn't shit on Aladdin, so that's pretty good. Okay. How about Tailspin? Hit it! Oh, 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 Tailspin! Oh, we oh, Tailspin! <laughs> oh, man, I used to watch a lot of Tailspin. It's okay. Um, 
it had its good episodes. It had its, eh, didn't care. It was kind of a mixed bag in my opinion. Hmm. I'll probably give it a D. I'm going to give Tailspin a D. Okay, now this one's kind of a weird cartoon, but I did kind of like it. Jumanji. The characters were kind of goofy. I don't think it was terrible. A B for Tailspin, really. Yeah, I don't think I could give that a B. I think Jumanji's probably a... Hmm. I'm going to give it a C. It's not bad. I think it's okay. Maybe I'm being biased. Okay, how about... Ren and Stimpy. <laughs> now, I actually didn't really care for this cartoon show. I, I think it... Hmm. I actually didn't really care for it. I would actually dare to give it an E. I actually didn't like it. Um, Alright, here's another one. Rugrats. <laughs> Freaking Rugrats, man. I do like some of their episodes, like their holiday specials, but like, overall, no, they're pretty lame. <laughs> so... Mm. Yeah, overall, I actually think it's an E. I don't really care for Rugrats. Besides just a couple episodes. Okay. Um, how about the Smurfs? So the Smurfs are really good. And I actually really enjoyed Gargamel, the villain. Uh, I watched a lot of Smurfs. I'm sure a lot of us have, you know. I think Smurfs is probably a, a solid B. I think Smurfs is pretty good, actually. Da la 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 la. <laughs> Oh, yeah. The crying was pretty annoying in Rugrats, yeah. I just thought it was kind of boring overall, besides a couple of episodes, but yeah. That's why I'm giving it an E. But yeah, Smurfs, I think, is a B. I was thinking A, but mm, I'll go B. I think B is a good spot for it. Alright. How about Captain Planet. Captain Planet, he's our hero. Gonna take pollution down to zero. I don't remember if that was the, the wording, but whatever. <laughs> Freaking Captain Planet. Um, I watched a bunch of Captain Planet as a kid, but at the same time, I was like, why am I watching this? <laughs> and that theme song, I don't know, just... Like, just pierced in my brain, you know? Captain Planet, he's a hero. He's gonna shit in your mouth. I don't know. Um. Uh. I will say this, though. I would rather watch Captain Planet over everything in the D. Or, excuse me, the E column. So, I'm gonna give Captain Planet a D. Yeah. That's true. The the theme song was kind of the only good thing. <laughs> Had a couple of good episodes. Uh, the villains were kind of, eh, you know, mixed bag. And then the kids, you know, I don't know, they're kind of dumb. <laughs> um, okay, how about Recess? The Recess, you know, I watched a decent amount, but I'm trying to think where I would put it. Like, I think it's okay. I might give it a D as well, to be honest with you. 
Yeah. Gonna hang out with Captain Planet, Tailspin. Now, how about South Park? Hey, out of all these cartoons, we haven't had too many A's or an S, huh? <laughs> so far as The Simpsons is the superior one. There'll be at least a couple more, I think. Now, South Park, like, I, I didn't watch a lot of South Park. It's funny, but, like, it's kind of weird. Not exactly my thing. Um, I'm sure most people like it, though. Where would you guys place South Park? Like for me, it's pretty much average. That's my opinion, you know. You say S? I don't think it's an S. There's no way it's on par with The Simpsons. I don't even think it's on par with Scooby-Doo and Pokemon. Pokemon's a little more of an argument, but... Probably, uh... I feel like it is a mixed opinion. I think it's either you're into it or you're not. So I'll put it in the C. All of them. That's probably, you know, accurate. Middle of the road. Okay. So. How about. Super Mario Brothers Super Show. Now. I'm going to be biased as hell. I love this cartoon show, right? I love the live action segments. Awesome. The guys that, the actors that played as Mario and Luigi, and then they had their like co stars between the cartoon episodes. Like, oh man, it was outstanding to me. I I'm just saying it. Mario is an S. I am being super biased. And of course the theme song is awesome. And since we're on that topic, I want to separate Zelda, even though it only had like 12 or 13 episodes, sadly. Well, excuse me, princess. I, I know it's very cheesy, it it is pretty cheesy, but I actually really love the cartoon series of Zelda. It's, it's a shame it had a short lifespan, but it didn't last very long. Sadly, but I remember I think like it would play every Friday, and I was always excited not to miss an episode. Just wish there was more, but um. This is where I'm being biased, because I really do, I like it. I'm going to give it an A, so I know people are going to argue with that, but... No, I really like it. It's my thing. I mean, I'm a Zelda guy, so I'm being biased, but I, I do like the cartoon series. S for Zelda, yeah. See, I couldn't give it an S, just because, you know... I mean, I, I want to, but to be a little realistic, I don't think it's an S. I think an A, though. I just wish it, it lasts longer. <laughs> I know it, like, you know, you would think it's annoying, like, when he goes, Excuse me, princess, but I actually loved it. It was funny. <laughs> it, it was really great. I mean, it was, um, it's a shame that it didn't last long. Like, I thought it was quite entertaining. Even though Ganon was kind of laughable and goofy. He was still funny, and to me, like, as a kid, you would think you'd love that, you know? Um, there's another big one. How about DuckTales? 
Now, you want to talk about arguably out of all, all the cartoon series, DuckTales probably has the best theme song. Either you love it or hate, like, the actual cartoons. I, I tell you, like, it had the theme song, that's for sure. Theme songs, like, S-tier all the way. As far as the cartoons, they actually were very good. It's just a matter if it's your cup of tea. And it, it isn't, but yet it was so good that... I would probably give Tuck, DuckTales an A. Because it's... It's pretty well done, really. You know? A for DuckTales. Yeah, see? Or an S. I, I tell you, that theme song's an S, that's for sure. I don't think you can get any better. You know, if I was going to be, like, a critic and, like... Like, r give it an honest rating, you know? Um... Now, I don't think that's my favorite theme song. Actually, no, it's not. Because I did my top 10 favorite theme song. So you guys know what it is. And we might as well talk about it. <laughs> Ninja Turtles. Now, I love Ninja Turtles. And it is my favorite theme song. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Turtles in a half shell. Turtle power. They're the world's most fearsome fighting teenage. Um... Yeah, it's pretty awesome. I would actually sing the whole thing, but uh, Lionsgate might actually copyright it just because <laughs> even if I'm the one singing it, fucking assholes. Um, yeah, I mean, Ninja Turtles is a freaking S. The only thing that's sad about Ninja Turtles when it got like towards the end, like was it season nine or even season 10, lost track. It really went downhill when they introduce like new villains like the uh, the alien dude forget his name I hated it. it it sucked but for the longest time like it was so like badass yeah it's awesome but yeah for me Ninja Turtles S and that, that is my favorite cartoon out of all of them Yeah, S for Turtles. Thank you for agreeing. Yeah, it's so badass. And, and it's not even just the Turtles. I mean, it's like all the characters are lovable. Even Shredder, Bebop, Rocksteady, Krang. Because they're like so... Like, they're even though they're evil, they're so dumb and they do funny stuff. Like, it's just hilarious. It, it's got a good mixture of comedy and action. Great music. The battle music's awesome. I mean, it's just really... Good, you know, yeah, I think it's an S all the way. Um, all right, how about Tiny Toon? Tiny Toon Adventures. I used to watch quite a bit of Tiny Toon, it wasn't my cup of tea, but it, it wasn't bad. I thought it was actually pretty good. I'm trying to think what to where to put it. Either a C or a B, I think. What do you guys think? I'm going to move these a little bit. Running out of room on the old uh, D column here. <clears throat> yeah it has a pretty good theme song as well I'll give it a B I think it, it's a B it is pretty good actually here we'll do this I'm kind of running out of room here <laughs> okay um, okay, how about Johnny Bravo? Now, the actual character, Johnny Bravo, he's hilarious. Um, as far as the overall episodes, they're kind of, I don't know. 
Uh, I loved his one Christmas episode. That was amazing. But overall, Johnny Bravo's, I don't know, he's probably no better than average, maybe even below average. Trying to think where to put him. I'm thinking either a C or a D. Believe it or not. Hmm. I like to give him higher, but... No. It's one of those things. E for Bravo. I loved it at first, but it got old. Yeah, you know, and that's that's that was well said. It did get old pretty quickly. I, I actually agree. That That's pretty well said. Yeah. You're right. Yeah, sadly, I, I guess it is a, a an E, huh? Yeah, yeah, I think you're... That's probably pretty right. Because there's only a couple episodes I like. Otherwise, they're kind of like, mm. Uh, all right, now here's one. <laughs> Remember Fat Albert? Oh my god, freaking Fat Albert. I, uh... I watched a couple episodes and I was like, yeah, this is very shitty. <laughs> the uh, the actual character, Fat Albert, he's lame as fuck. The cartoons is lame. It's an F. <laughs> I don't think it lasted long. I think it, it tanked pretty fast. Um, now, how about Rocky and Bullwinkle? Now, I know this is a classic. I never really cared for Rocky and Bullwinkle. I don't really like them at all, actually. So, I'm just going to be a complete asshole and give Rocky and Bullwinkle an F as well. <laughs> so, this is probably where I'll get criticized. I just don't care for them, like, literally at all. That is crazy, Lexi. You need to watch some cartoons. You're missing out. So Lexi, after this stream, you should watch some Ninja Turtles, some Super Mario Bros. Uh, Super Mario Brothers Super Show is actually on Netflix. Same with Pokemon the 2000. 2000, remember that. Not the later ones, because they suck. Uh, Scooby-Doo may be on there. So yeah, you need to do that. Okay, any of you guys remember Gargoyles? Now, Gargoyles, you know, I kind of look at that as Johnny Bravo. It was pretty amazing at first, and then it kind of, like, I don't know, got really old. I think it's better than Johnny Bravo, though. I think Gargoyles, I'd probably, probably going to shock people, I'd probably give it a D. Because in a way, I kind of lost interest with it. But when you like first watch it, you're like, oh, this seems badass. But then it's kind of like, eh, you know. You would say D as well. Yeah, I, I think it's a D. Um, Here's a classic. Now, what do you guys think of Doug? I love the newspaper comics of him, you know. Those are awesome. I, I vaguely remember the cartoon show of him, though. Uh, maybe there's a reason. Maybe I didn't really get into it as much as, like, the newspaper comics, you know? Yeah, I'm trying to think where I would put Doug. Hmm. Because he's a pretty lovable character. You would say A, hey, really? See, I don't know if I'd go that high, though. But, you know, that's just me. Disney F. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, there is multiple versions, huh? Yeah. I forgot about that. 
I'll tell you what, to be safe, I'll say a C. We'll put it in the middle. Maybe I shouldn't have included it, because that's a good point. Okay, how about Sailor Moon? Now, it's kind of weird. I wanted to include this one because, okay, Guilty Pleasure, I kind of like this. <laughs> and this one actually has a very good theme song as well. Um, I mean, Sailor Moon, actually, I'm, I'm just going to be honest, I'd probably give it a B straight up. I actually like it, so you guys can judge me. I actually like it. <laughs> um, this one I actually need a little more help because I don't. I vaguely remember this. It's been a long time that I've seen. Here, I'll put it over here. Thundercats. What would you guys rate Thundercats? Man, I should I should watch that again. I just don't remember it. It's been so long. Thundercats. While you guys are making a decision, I'm going to um grab the image for the real Ghostbusters. Oops. I'll just use this logo. That works. S for Sailor Moon, Japanese version. U uh, USA version C. See, and I, I am kind of thinking the Japanese version. Guess you guys haven't really seen Thundercats. Yeah, I wish I can remember. I might just say C for Thundercats. Hmm. I do want to watch it again. I don't even remember who owns Thundercats. I wonder if it's on Netflix. Probably not. I don't know who has the rights to it. Uh, yeah, I'll just say C. C is like pretty full. <laughs> like a cluster fuck. <laughs> okay. So, the real Ghostbusters. Now, I love the real Ghostbusters. I'm going to say A. Great theme song. And I actually really overall enjoy the cartoon episodes, so yeah, I think it's an A. And maybe I'm being biased. I, I really like Ghostbusters. Um, now, have any of you guys, probably not many, have seen Sh She-Ra. I think that's how you pronounce it. She-Ra. I, um... Yeah. I would probably just give it an F. Because, yeah, I'm just an ass. <laughs> now this one, uh, I want some honest opinions with He-Man. He-Man. It's an old classic. Now I think this one's on Netflix, so I'll have to watch He-Man. Again, A for real Ghostbusters. Yeah. How about He-Man? I'm glad you guys agreed with me on that. Yeah, I love the real Ghostbusters. A little better than the other Ghostbusters cartoon series. <laughs> oh, jeez.
You never saw He-Man? Yeah, see, I don't remember it that well. Uh, it's It's got pretty, um, some pretty awesome villains. I'll tell you what. Because He-Man was pretty good. I'll go ahead and give it a B. Give it a B. I'll be curious what if I'll be agreeing with a B. Because I'll, I'll watch it on Netflix. Okay. Dark Wayne Duck. Now this one has a great theme song as well. Better watch out, you bad boys. Dark Wayne Duck. The Dark Wayne Duck, yeah, is pretty awesome. Uh, hmm. I think Dark Wayne Duck is. It's kind of interesting with me because sometimes I think I like Dark Wayne Duck over. DuckTales, but I think hands down, DuckTales is the much better cartoon series. Um, hmm. I may give DuckTales a B. I feel like maybe that's where it should go. Oh, S for DuckTales. Oh. Ooh. I'll tell you what. I mean, DuckTales is pretty good, actually. Or Darkwing Duck, excuse me. Yeah, we'll give it an A. Oh, yeah, it is, Lexi. Yeah, just make sure it's the 2000. And it's, it's really good. Um, You know, you talk about, like, theme songs. Pokemon arguably has the best theme song. Out of all the cartoons. It's really, it's really good. So yeah, guys, I guess this is our list. Yeah, with, with cartoons, like, it is a little rough. I mean, it's like anything when it comes to, like, movies, cartoons. Probably even music, because we all, you know, we're all different, you know. We have different tastes. But, uh, so, yeah, three of them made the S tier. The Simpsons, Super Mario Brothers Super Show, and Ninja Turtles. Quite a few in the A. A lot of C's, which, yeah, I think a lot of these cartoons are average, give or take. But, yeah. On the A column, we have Scooby-Doo, Pokemon, the 2000, Zelda, which that's just me being biased. <laughs> DuckTales, The Real Ghostbusters, and Darkwing Duck. Yeah. The ones that got the 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 big middle finger, the the shit of shits is Care Bears, Ghostbusters, the fake one, fake Ghostbusters, <laughs> Fat Albert, um Rocky and Bullwinkle, and uh She-Ra. Mm. Yeah, if it wasn't for the live motion segments, I would probably give ALF an F as well. Good list, Joey. Oh, thank you. Yeah. It, it's tough sometimes, you know. I think it's, for the most part, pretty accurate. I wish I remembered Thundercats better. But, uh... Yeah. Well, that's cool. Well, it's not too bad. We did this in like an hour. Okay. Wasn't too much of a marathon. <laughs> yeah, guys. If I do not mention your favorite cartoon, just leave it in the comments below, you know. What's your favorite cartoons if it's not on here? You know. Or if it is and 
you know, I didn't give it justice, you know. But, yeah. What my list looks like, so, as always, guys, thanks for watching, and uh, leave suggestions what I should do next for this tier chart, you know. So, I was wanting to do this one for a while, but just been delaying it. So, yeah, take care, guys.